John Mad Dog Hall. I'm the executive director of Linux International. And I do a lot of work for the Linero organization that puts GNU Linux on top of ARM processors. Well, the greatest innovation is actually the model of free software and how do you make money with free software and free culture. I think this was, although it was developed first by Richard Stallman, it actually was magnified a lot by the Linux kernel the Linux, and the GNU Linux operating system. I still feel that is the greatest contribution. Uh, well, I would recommend, uh, you know, it's, it's ARM processors are very low power. They use do a lot of computation for a very small amount of electricity. Uh, things like the Raspberry Pi use an ARM processor. It runs on three watts of power, which is one twentieth of what a light bulb uses, and does some pretty amazing things. I think the real thing that we're trying to encourage with this contest is that people really understand how the computer works and so that they can write efficient code on their, on their system. Well, that, that, the answer to that changes as you go from country to country. I think in a country like Mexico, the fact that you do not have to send a lot of money for free software outside of the boundary of Mexico to the United States and you can instead use that money to take free software and improve it, paying local programmers to pay to write that code. When you pay local programmers to write that code, they then have that money to buy local food, local housing, and pay local taxes. It also develops a, a technology area that attracts other business. If you keep sending your money to the United States and asking them to write these compilers and these operating systems, then you're not developing that expertise inside of Mexico. That's very important.